USS Carl Vinson, CVN-70, is the United States Navy's third Nimitz-class supercarrier. She is named for Carl Vinson, a congressman from Georgia, in recognition of his contributions to the U.S. Navy. Carl Vinson was an American politician who served in the U.S. House of Representatives for over 50 years and was influential in the 20th century expansion of the U.S. Navy. He was known as the father of the Two Ocean Navy, he is the longest serving member of the United States House of Representatives from the state of Georgia. The ship was launched in 1980, undertook her maiden voyage in 1983, and underwent refueling and overhaul between 2005 and 2009. Besides deployments in Operation Desert Strike, Operation Iraqi Freedom, Operation Southern Watch, and Operation Enduring Freedom, Carl Vinson was involved in a number of notable events. The body of Osama bin Laden was buried at sea in 2011 from the deck of Carl Vinson, and that same year, on Veterans Day, she played host to the first NCAA basketball game on an aircraft carrier, between North Carolina and Michigan State. In November 2005, Carl Vinson became the third Nimitz-class carrier to undergo a midlife refueling and complex overhaul, which was scheduled to last 36 months. The ship moved out of dry dock to a pier site berth at Northrop Grumman Newport News Shipyard in May 2007. In October 2009, the U.S. Navy announced that Carl Vinson would be the flagship of the newly established Carrier Strike Group 1, CESG-1, based in San Diego. The ship, under the command of then-Captain Bruce H. Lindsay, departed Norfolk for San Diego on 12 January 2010. Accompanying the carrier was Carrier Air Wing 17, Destroyer Squadron 1 and the guided missile cruiser Bunker Hill. USS Bunker Hill, CG-52, is a Ticonderoga-class guided missile cruiser of the United States Navy constructed by Lytton Ingalls Shipbuilding Corporation at Pascagoula, Mississippi and launched on the 11th of March 1985. The COVID-19 pandemic was reported to have spread to the crew of Carl Vinson when its first case was reported on 23 March 2020. At the time, the ship was in dry dock for maintenance at Puget Sound Naval Shipyard, and it was reported that the sailor did not board the vessel and had no contact with any shipyard personnel. On 8 January 2020, it was announced that Carl Vinson will be changing home port back to San Diego bringing the number of San Diego-based carriers from 2 to 3, joining Theodore Roosevelt and Abraham Lincoln. On the 2nd of September 2020, Carl Vinson arrived in her new home port of San Diego following a 17-month overhaul at Puget Sound Naval Shipyard. Carl Vinson left San Diego for her next deployment on the 3rd of August 2021, with CVW-2 embarked. 
One of the squadrons assigned to CVW-2 was Strike Fighter Squadron 147. Hope you guys loved the video. Don't forget to hit the like button and please do subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to all. So you can get the notification on each upload.